Hey guys, this is Break It Up. Today I'll be showing you how to quickly and easily get rid of your unresponsive start menu in your windows. Recently I got this update, a uh, huge update I guess. But uh, after that uh, I got this uh, start menu stopped working. So if I click it, it does not respond. Uh, but this clicks, uh, this responds now. As I worked a method to uh, work it again. So I'll be showing you how to get rid of the unresponsive start menu bug in this video. So let's get started. So what you firstly wanted is uh, I got here new test document. Here get this xml file installation mode it is a app package refreshing mode uh, and uh, it's a development mode restring disabling uh, development mode restring uh, xml file so i got here and uh, i'll be providing you this in the description box it can get it there so first of all what you have to do is uh, go to the taskbar right there and open task manager and uh, in this option uh, you got this file option and select the run new task and uh, type powershell i already typed here the powershell so you have to type it the powershell and uh, don't forget to click the tick button here the create this task with uh, administrative privileges so okay so we got here the window the windows partial window here so i'm gonna minimize this and uh, i'll be closing this task manager and i'm going to the test file document and uh, i'm going to select all by control a and I'll be copying this with uh, Control C. So and I again I am going back to the PowerShell command window here, and uh, simply clicking. So I got this copied this link right here. The disabling the development mode uh, and restoring it. Uh, and uh, what this uh, does do right here is. Uh, refreshing the whole system and disabling the development mode so i'm going to enter and start running this xml file here so it got this processing uh, option here so the development operation progress is just started and uh, when it starts, uh, wait for it to fully run this process. I take a five minute, maybe less or so. Meanwhile, what you can do is uh, uh, go to your settings. You can go to settings by clicking open and uh, open settings and uh, select the system option right here and select the tablet mode. Switch to this to tablet mode and. Uh, Click on the start button whether it works or not. Click several times and again switch it to normal mode and click it. Now it won't respond. So do this uh, sometime, do this 
sometime and uh, and switch back to the normal board and uh, we are going back to the our location and uh, what we got here so I got this error right here um, some error if you get any error like this I just ignore it it doesn't really matter So what we have to do right now is we have to wait the sender process to be done. So the six activities are now shown. Now the start button not responding and sometimes it responds. Wait for this program to be followed. I already done this step uh, so uh, I don't be having much issue with my server. So if you are uh, doing this uh, first time, uh, wait for it to complete the full process and uh, you will get a good result with this. So it worked for me, I, uh, so I'm gonna close this. Also, operation so it did an access is not shown so if you are doing this uh, please enable to complete the full operation uh, I am just closing it because I already have a working start menu here so and uh, do not make sure to switching the tablet mode and normal mode uh, while the processing is done so that's for today thank you guys for watching and i hope you guys enjoyed this video and helped this video if this video is much help for you please do subscribe and uh, thank you for watching guys see you in the next video